hoy. Welcome back to the farm. We're at Westbridge Hills, Tenacious Viking, your farmer host. <laughs> and uh, let's see what we're up to. I don't look pretty. That's, uh, well, I guess that's sunset, huh? We have, I don't think we have anything positioned because why would we? Oh, I do have a. Why don't I have a tractor here? What am I? Oh, I know what I'm planning to, to, to do. Haha. <laughs> It's all coming back to me now. Okay. Let's... Where did the... Oh. I really want... There, that's the one I want. All right, let's um, take a look at where we're at on crops. We've got... Um, 10 and 11 are growing pretty fast. Uh, and I'm in 120 times, so they could ripen pretty quickly. And of course we have corn in 19 and 20, barley in 10 and 16, canola on 11 and 17, and wheat on field 7. I should see what I've got uh, mission set at. I, five minutes, okay. And since I'm at time scale 120, uh, things will be happening fairly quickly. So I'm going to actually slow down <coughs> to 60 times because um, I got some money. And I want to do a couple of things. I told you that I would let you in on it when I'm buying stuff. <coughs> Remember I've been having trouble steering um, the case with that um, mower behind it. And so uh, I'll pretty quickly be adding um, mowers to that and a better tractor so I can I can mow grass more efficiently. So I'm gonna I'm gonna just get another one of these uh, small inexpensive mowers to use um, on the field. Oh, I don't want to do that yet. On the field, um, uh, what's going to be the um, the baseball field and the real estate uh, area, and see if that uh, steers better. Now, this one I've been looking at. It's fairly inexpensive. It'll load grass, hay, straw, or chaff, and it's self-propelled, so I don't have to buy a tractor. It's not the best thing I've ever seen, but hopefully it'll work. And um, I can use that to pick up some grass. Some, actually, I'll use it to pick up some straw initially and sell that. So, let's go to the store <coughs> and pick up our purchases. I want to do the, uh, actually do the mower first because I need to get that into position. So, I think this is right. Hopefully it'll make it easier to steer this. And um, I'm not sure what the best route is. And drive by some of the fields too while we're doing this. But I want to be in position in case a um, mission comes up. I won't need the uh, grass catcher um, until harvest season starts. So I have some time to uh, position equipment for that. I'm not sure if the small combine drops straw or not. I think it does. I think that's the only one that does right now, which is fine. Uh, we don't need that much. And it takes time to pick that straw up. That's one of the reasons I don't do it a lot. But it does provide a little extra money. 
frankly, I'd rather do that than pallet missions. I think we have a great demand for something. Maybe not. Nope, not anymore. Oh yeah, we had a great demand for corn, but it was less than what we got. Uh, yep, see there we go. Oh, the drive-in. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to do that. <coughs> I want to get this positioned real quick first. It's going to slow down time again a little, a little bit more. Interesting to see now if this thing uh, stays put in here better with this mower. Why is that tractor working so hard with that little mower behind it? This will slow me down mowing a little bit, but with uh, the speed that I'm... I'm using. Uh, we'll have to come back and pick that up. There we go. This is what needs to be done. Where that sucker slide down the hill on me? Turkey. I hadn't exactly planned to open the day by mowing for you, but you know, whatever needs to be done, I guess. So obviously, uh, since the last time we were on the farm, uh, the harvesting got finished, the planting got done. <coughs> really haven't taken a lot of time to look at uh, prices. Well, canola is supposed to be on its way up, but it's not at 1,200 yet. It's interesting that even after I sold a trailer full of corn at 701. There's still a great demand for it at 600. Not sure about the mechanics, game mechanics. Doesn't make much sense. But oh, 608 corn now. I guess we need to grow more corn. We better make field 21 a priority till we can catch up on corn and keep up with it so that the bottom of the market can drop out on me. I'm really not happy with uh, canola. That usually goes up above 1,200 on a regular basis, and it hasn't done that. But, you know, I got a bunch of it uh, on hand, and I can sell it for quite a lot. How much do you have? I hear you cry. Well, let's check. See, I got 248,000. Um, 200,000 of that. I can make, make $200,000 pretty quickly just by two trips selling canola. And that maybe should be what I do. I should run a tractor trailer over to field 21 and see how much that costs. If I'm going to buy that next, I'd like to do it if, you know, before we get to planting so that we can just plant that along with the other corn. I could just uh, keep this, you know, going slower and do more missions off camera to make a little more money. Um, I might do that. $10,000, okay, that gives me a little bit of money to harvest with.
I wonder if I should take... Uh, let's see. I'm going to bring this to field... Did I bring this to field 10 or to... I think I'll bring this to field 16. Uh, except I don't know what's ripe and what isn't. Oh, everything's ripe. Yeah, we're going to go to field 16 with this. I hope that's the right, right way to do that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what I did before. It's only stage one ripeness yet. I'd really like to have sold some of that canola before we got into um, before we got into harvest season what I might do is bring the first trailer straight to, s to sell it um, I'm going to run this over to field 21 real quick. See how much it costs. Oh, I can t oh, wait, I can tell that anyway. I don't need to run it over. I can just go to the bank. Okay. My bad. Over to field with this. I wonder if the small harvester can handle field 17 all by itself. I think we're going to try that. Keep uh, this harvester on 10, 11, and then go up to 7 this time. Let's see what happens. I may never get a chance to pick it. Well, I have to pick up the chap. Uh, the loader wagon. Because I need to be picking up straw on field 16. Also means disabled chopper. I don't know what key that is. I think it's the what is it, period? Comma. There, it's the comma. Okay, so that sh this field should also leave uh that's not positioned very well. I can be more efficient than that. There. Okay. So I always manage to get a shot of the side of this when I use it. <laughs> That's because I can. Oh, almost ran the sign down. Whoa. Well, that was very smart. Okay. There. Yeah, I need to turn missions off. That's going to be annoying as all get out. Oh, I keep thinking it's folded. Uh, I'm so dumb. Why didn't I not why did I not fold that? 
Doesn't switch. I thought there were controls on the combine to unfold that too, but nope. I have no idea how to run this thing. That sounds terrible. It's ooh, a pretty old dude. But like I say, it's self propelled, and for what I need, I think it'll be fine. I just hope I'm right that I can actually sell this like I could in Hagenstadt. Otherwise I'm going to be stuck with some straw I'll have to bring down to the cattle farm, I suppose, and dump it in there. Of course, you have to do this manually uh, before you can cultivate. So, this is going to be a little slow down the planting process a little bit on the barley, but hopefully it'll work out. Okay. I gotta find there is the trailer I need. All right. Finally, we are ready. We have still only have stage one ripeness. Wow. Well, let's do that. Sure. That'd be great. Okay, so we are all set. Um, yeah, let's speed this up a bit. And while we're waiting, go to the Bank of Hagenstedt and check out, what is it, Field 21, 241,000. Wow, that is... Expensive. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Well, you know, I could do it if I, um, if I sold a load of canola. Let's do, let's, um, slow this down. Let's go sell a load. And hopefully the price will hold up when we get um, we harvest another trailer. <coughs> Canola is number three, I think, right? Yep. Yeah. 
Make sure that price. Oh, that price is a little better even. Good. It's leveling off though. What's the barley doing? Is that at a decent level? Nope. Sugar beets are dropping. Oh, too bad. Barley's sneaking up a little bit, but it's not that great. Yeah, flour mill is the best. Best price. Okay. Five times, see if we can get stage two ripeness on this stuff. I've thought about just going five times all the time, but um, the planting goes too slow. I suppose I could just slow it down for planting and then. I don't know. So we're selling canola so that we can buy field 21 and expand our corn production because the price on corn has been very good actually. It's the only thing that's around staying around 600 or higher regularly. And you know the reason I plant a lot of canola is so that I can make a bunch of money when I need it even though the yield is not that good. Actually, it's half the others. But once you've got it in the barn, it's uh, pretty good. Anything over a thousand on here uh, is is kind of gravy for our farming operation too so see we almost have enough to buy that field now so even if we don't get a great price for another load of canola it'll put us over the top on buying field 21 allowing us to plant more corn 